Hello everyone, I'm Argama and um, as a bonus tutorial I'm going to show you how to uh, do the X mouth for uh, uh, iPhone tracking, yeah. Hmm, <laughs> it's that thing, you know, when you move your mouth back and forth. Okay. <laughs> Um, all right, so uh, I'm over here and I'm working on this model and I've just done the mouth forms, blah, 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 blah. Um, and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab all of the mouth pieces like that. I just selected them all and I'm going to put them in a deformer and I'm going to just call it mouth X. And then down here, I'm going to add a new parameter, mouth X. And I'm going to do like a, I'm going to do like a negative 10 and a positive 10. Like, I don't think they really matter, but yeah. And so what I'm going to do now is when I come over here, I'm just going to kind of like twist it and move it over. And then over here, I'm going to kind of twist it and move it over. So it's kind of like that. Um, and one thing you can do is you can adjust the jaw to move with it. You can adjust the nose to go with it, which is usually what I have done in the past. Um, I grab the nose parts and I'm going to put it in a deformer. I'm going to call this nose mouth X. And then here. I'm gonna just kind of give it a little like pull up not nothing big nothing drastic just a little so it looks like the nose is wiggling just a little bit and uh, with the jaw I'll do the same thing so I'm gonna put this into deformer and I'm gonna go mouth X so here when it's over here it's just gonna kind of Pull and adjust a little bit. And then this way, I'm gonna kind of pull and adjust a little bit. Uh, but for the most part, that's that's pretty much how you would do it. Uh, you would could adjust the jaw, adjust the nose, and you make sure it matches all around. And then when you go into uh, VTube Studio, which we have here, um, we're going to go into like the settings and over in this uh, tracking one, the guy with the gear. Uh, now, mind you, you have to be set up for iPhone tracking, but you're going to add a new parameter and it's basically going to be mouth X. So you're going to just make the input uh, mouth X and it should be able to pick up on it on your iPhone, uh, especially if you send the model to the phone. Uh, same with the, the tongue, if you do the tongue. Although, uh, for me, the tongue didn't work out too great. I don't know. I just, I was just experimenting with the tongue. I didn't, don't really have need for it, but, um... <laughs> uh yeah that's pretty much how you would do the um iphone uh tracking mouth x parameter uh yeah <laughs> i don't really know what else to say about it it's it's pretty simple it's just a little like twist twist uh you might have to adjust things a little bit depending on which angle you're going on but yeah, I just wanted to show you that since I'm working on this other uh, model and I didn't really touch on it on the other tutorial series. So, yep. All right. Uh, see ya. Bye. <laughs>